Dylan here, and I want to take a minute out of your time to discuss perhaps one of the most important topics of the Trump era, fake news, or in another term, I like to say, gossip. Earlier, when the world was completely different back in January of 2020, I read an article that the average person spends 52 minutes a day gossiping about other people. That's a whole lot of talking about fake news and about politics or about religion or spreading rumors that may or may not be true, saying things to, about other people that you may not have witnessed or you may not know uh, going on every day. 52 minutes a day, that's the average American individual spending 52 minutes per day gossiping about other people, their friends, their family, everyone. That's a lot, a lot of time. And at first, it might just seem harmless. There's nothing against you if you're a person that spends, you know, talk about other people. It's no big deal. It doesn't hurt you any if you spread rumors about someone else. But it can cause long-term lasting mental health problems um, for the person and impact that other individual's life rather good or bad. So the way you should gossip about someone is highlighting the positive attributes of someone and getting rid of the negative, right? Human beings are biased towards negative information. So anything negative are the ones that are more sticky. So when we gossip about other people, it's usually on the negative side of things and it veers into bullying other people. Uh, what we should do is practice positive gossiping and word of mouth in which we talk about the positive attributes of the individual as opposed to the negative. Um, that helps us feel better about ourselves when we gossip about other people, uh, that we're a positive person because we talk about other people in a positive way. Um, and it makes the other person's life that we're talking about better because their reputation, which basically is what other people gossip about them, uh, it becomes more positive in the long term. In the short term, if those that does not happen and everything is way over on the negative side, it could cause lasting mental health benefits, not f only for you, but the person you're talking about. It could lead to exhaustion, anxiety, depression, post-traumatic stress disorder, panic attacks, guilt, uh, mental illness that's clinically like diagnosed as depression or some other disorder um, and eventually might even lead to suicide so in 2020 when the average per person spends 52 minutes talking about someone else or talking about other people it could be co-workers it could be your friends it could be family it could be politicians it could be whatever you whatever it is right um, it's important to keep that there are severe problems when those things could go unaddressed um, for the person you're talking about or, or your friends or family and and for yourself too. I don't feel like I'm a good person when I talk bad about someone else, um, but it happens, right? We're only human. Uh, sometimes talking about other people is, you know, part of being human, but it's important that we try to make it as positive as possible. Uh, that way it helps you, the person, feel better about yourself and the other person you're talking about feel be better about them. And remember empathy, right? Like put yourself in someone else's shoes. Even though, you know, something negative may have been done by someone and it's gossiped about, you don't know the context if you weren't there, right? Um, it could be taken out of context. It could be like a political thing in which you, you know, just take something completely out of the situation and that becomes it right um, that could be a problem too so uh, 52 minutes a day is a long time to talk about other people which is happens every day and over the course of a year or a month or two years or 10 years that's a lot of gossip right um, so try to be a little bit more positive about it highlight po someone's positive attributes um, makes yourself feel better and it makes the other person people you talk about lives better too um that's it guys have a good one and uh enjoy staying at home and social distancing and keep carrying on